guys, Joseph Hanna here at No Reserve Classics. Today we're going to be presenting to you guys the best of the best of first gen Camaros. This 1969 Camaro full pro touring car was built by Bobby Johnson. Well over a quarter million dollars to build this work of art. It is a fuel injected 496 cubic inch all aluminum Donovan big block with a twin turbo, a custom TCI built TH400 transmission, black hound tooth interior, and a custom full pro touring independent Corvette suspension that has been custom built just for this car. So let's talk about the exterior of this car. I'm gonna sum this up in one word, perfect. Bobby Johnson is a magician at body and paint work, and this is the telltale sign. This car is exactly the explanation of that. Absolutely perfect lines and absolutely perfect flat glossy paint with the perfect amount of clear, the perfect wet sanding and buffing, all blended together to just make a true work of art. But let's talk about one of the most important and cool things of this car, and it's the name The Real. According to Chevy Hardcore, the name The Real came from, when this car was being built, it was built from an original 1969 Camaro True RS SS. They wanted to keep that as original and true as possible when they were building this car, and they did a perfect job doing it. A full twin turbo pro touring car that you could actually daily drive that looks like that factory original appeal of why we love these cars so much is exactly what this car is. Looking at the front of the car, you'll notice over the front spoiler, there are these vents. They're very inconspicuous. You can't really notice them too much, but they're subtly done, and that's what brings cool air into the twin turbos of this car. Going on to the top of that, you'll notice the Enduro bumper, the gloss black Enduro bumper. And of course, this car was retrofitted with our infamous <laughs> resto modded headlight kit with the angel eyes, LEDs, and bottom fog lights that turn into turn signals as well, LED turn signals. As we move to the side of the car, you'll notice the Colorado custom wheels. These wheels were custom specially built for this car. They're 18 by 9.5s in the front and 18 by 12s in the rear. You have a 315 40 tire, super wide tire, and a 255 tire in the front. The perfect combination and they look absolutely immaculate with this car. Going over to the rear of the car, you'll notice all the correct RS lights over there, the correct RS tail lights, reverse signal lights, D80 spoiler package, and the vinyl top just sets this car off perfect. What I love most about the body of this build is it's timeless. 50 years from now, we're still gonna remember that iconic 1969 Camaro, and this is exactly how this car was built to look like from the outside without crazy deviations and custom work. Yet you still have a car that's detuned at 700 horsepower, it's actually a thousand horsepower, that has a 496 inch twin turbo car that can actually be used as a daily driver with the pro touring suspension and brakes. So let's talk about the heart and soul of this car, guys. This is it, this is where all the power comes from. And all hand fabricated, custom made, just a true, beautiful, again, work of art, just like the rest of the car. Guys, it's a Donovan all aluminum, 496 cubic inch big block. It's Dart CNC ported heads, twin 76 millimeter turbonetic turbochargers at a conservative nine PSI, custom plumbing, intercooler, intake and exhaust, and a one-of-a-kind dual plenum aluminum intake manifold. Dual throttle bodies, direct port fuel injection, and a custom-built turbo 400 transmission with a custom converter and gear vendors overdrive, and of course, power steering. Now, the fuel injection is easily tunable. It's been updated to a modern computer system. So anybody who could tune a Holley Sniper or a, or a Holley Fast Fuel Injection System or a Fitec system, you can click your laptop on it and tune it to exactly what you need. But as far as the rest of it and as far as aesthetics and the way it looks, absolutely gorgeous. Valve covers were custom powder coated, a gloss black to match the exterior of the car. Custom vintage style Chevrolet emblems really complements the overall design of this car. Custom hood hinges that have been converted over to hydraulic. I mean, underneath the hood, every single portion, stainless steel button head bolts all the way around. Again, perfection and just a real close attention to detail.
So how would a Pro Touring 1000 horsepower twin turbo 1969 Camaro with all original Peel's interior look like? Just like this one, guys. This thing is awesome. Factory style deluxe interior with slight modifications to make sure that everything fits and finishes well. For example, the door panel. Well, the door panel is a deluxe factory style door panel, but has to work in accordance with, of course, the roll cage. That's absolutely a necessity for this car. And if you'll notice on the door panel, it was custom molded and stitched to fit the roll cage just like a glove. Now looking at the center console, you'll notice there is center console gauges, but the center console is still a factory center console. And that TCI Turbo 400 transmission works phenomenal with the factory style staple shifter. Along the center over there, you'll notice that there's a cup holder over there. That was just something that was added by us. I figure if you are gonna be driving this car daily or on long distances, you are gonna want a cup holder in there, especially if you're like me and you need your cup of coffee in the morning, right? Looking at the cockpit of the car, you'll notice the steering wheel. The steering wheel is that factory style wood grain steering wheel that would have been born on this car in 1969 as an original RSSS car. That's, that's the steering wheel that you'd get. You look at the tachometer, factory style tachometer, factory style speedometer, factory style dash carrier pad. Everything just looks completely factory and awesome. But if you look in the center where the center clock would be, there's not. There's a turbo boost gauge over there which is something you would need on a twin turbo car like this. Going over to the left-hand side of that dash carrier, you'll notice the overdrive switch. So if you're driving on a long cruise, yes, you do have overdrive with this car. You slip it onto overdrive, and it'll drop down the gears, um, and you'll be able to drive long distance at a decent RPM and go a lot faster, move a lot faster, which works good in coordinates with the 354 gears. Also, what's really important for a pro touring car air conditioning yes this car is equipped with air conditioning and it was actually a factory air car and was retrofitted with a vintage air system inside this car also you'll notice the radio in this car is definitely not original it's an alpine radio and this car is retrofitted with an awesome sound system so along with air conditioning you need your tune especially if you're on a two or three hour trip you got a memphis subwoofer in the rear memphis speakers all the way around alpine stereo sounds absolutely phenomenal seats are super comfortable back seats super comfortable factory style again deluxe factory style houndstooth black and white seats that fits the black and white tuxedo appeal of this car perfectly absolutely awesome interior an interior that you'd be absolutely proud to take to a car show my favorite part about this car is actually the underbody just so meticulously perfectly done absolutely gorgeous floors a full corvette independent rear suspension full corvette front suspension adjustable coilovers all the way around a dana 44 rear end with 354 gears that's perfect for cruising and can handle all that power that's up front of course power steering their qa1 coilovers on all four corners that again are fully adjustable thicker sway bar the whole chassis is a two inch box full chassis fuel cells in the trunk Everything is polished, gorgeous. The underbody paint is just as beautiful as the top of the car. An awesome car for you to go to a car show, put some mirrors underneath it, and be extremely proud. Well, I don't think anybody would not be proud of anything about this car, but you could be extremely proud with that underbody. Overall, if you are the guy or gal that is looking for the absolute most one-of-a-kind first-gen Camaro, that is the absolute best of the best, in an all original body and something that you could actually pro tour and drive, this is the car. Pay close attention to this car. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity to own something this special. 1969 Camaro, all original body panels, twin turbo, 496 cubic inch, all aluminum Donovan block, TCI built, turbo 400 trans, custom Corvette, independent suspension all the way around. Willwood giant six piston or multi piston disc brakes in the front and rear. I think the total diameter is like 17 inches. Again, if you guys just want the best of the best, pay close attention to this car because this is a once in a lifetime opportunity to own something like this machine. This is Joseph Hanna from No Reserve Classics. Like us and follow us on Facebook and Instagram. And don't forget to check out our cool videos of this car and us just having a lot of fun with all of our other pro touring cars on YouTube.